Hi guys, hope you all are fine and doing well. A very good morning and let's begin the day with this breakfast. And uh, meanwhile, it started raining. It was an off day for me. So in the mid morning, it was raining uh, like this. After a long time, it rained. And uh, it was such a blissful time. Then uh, me and my friend, uh, we decided to go out for lunch. And uh, here we had lunch. And uh, there was a child selling these rose gajras and uh, we bought it from her. And uh, then we went to the tea stall to grab a cup of tea. I had tea and uh, my friend, she had uh, ice cream. And look at these gajras, these were looking really beautiful and the fragrance was just uh, nourishing our senses. This tea was also good and this place had a very that foodie and that uh, tempting vibe. And then we came back to the hostel and uh, in the evening I decided to make gajar kalwa because winter is incomplete without making such delicacies. So here I grated the carrots then I cooked them. I have uh, already shared the detailed recipe of gajar ka halwa in another video. I will link that in the description box. So here I just added condensed milk to it. So just it will enhance the flavor a little more and some dry fruits also and uh, then it was ready it was looking really yum and everybody loved it and uh, enjoyed it then for the uh, uh, dinner we ordered lasagna and uh, had our dinner and uh, then I had to pack some books so i decided to share the packing of books with you here i'm packing the books in the carton so i have just already packed some books like this i'm using uh, this cling wrap which we use in our kitchen for uh, covering the foods like this then scissors and then i'm taking the books one by one and just uh, wrapping this cling wrap over them just clean the books if they have some dirt or dust over them just place it on the cling wrap leave some of the wrap uh, there just fold it and uh, just then wrap it around like this you don't need any adhesive or any uh, tapes for this cling wrap just uh, covers everything because it's very thin and soft this is a good way to keep your books uh, neat and pack them neatly for long distances uh, because books won't get damaged this way and will also remain safe and secure then another tip for packing the books is that uh, pack the books tightly in the carton or in a bag in whatever you are packing them. Do not let any spaces in between like this uh, carton is packed very uh, carefully and neatly neither it is packed too heavily and uh, nor does it have any spaces left in between and the, then we are finally closing the carton with this uh, tape and we have also made the labels for the cartons in which uh, uh, we have written what stuff each carton carries that is also a good way to remember and to identify your stuff then we are just uh, closing it and uh, also applying the uh, adhesive tape on the bottom of the carton to make it more secure 
so i hope you will find this packing tip helpful then winding up the day with a dash of fruit i hope you like this video thank you take care and goodbye